Good evening, everyone. We are here to find out the future from Taboo, the Sixth Sense. Our, all that has been and all that will be is here for you to know. Dare you glimpse the future? Dare you even ask? Taboo, the time machine on Nintendo. First, I will start by entering my name. I'm Mo. Hello. And, uh... Then I will enter my birthday, which is... Uh... I don't actually know. Whatever. It's this. That's my birthday. Sorry, I'm a chicken. I don't remember these things. And I'm male. So, our question today... Is... No, not is. Is... Star ship Hector B Bull <laughs> Is Starship Hector beatable? And now it will shuffle the cards. Yes! This is a Nintendo tarot card simulator. That's right! And periodically I will ask it questions. We are going to find out tonight if Starship Hector is beatable from this perfect, 100% accurate tarot card reading. Here we go. One, two, three, four, Five. Now, if I was a cool guy, I would actually know what all of these are called, but I don't. I'm not a cool guy. I'm sorry. Uh, I just think of them as numbers. Oh, wait, hang on. Sometimes, every once in a while... Ah, uh, I didn't do it. Every once in a while, there will be, like, a skull. So, maybe we'll see that in the future. First, your present position is what health, wealth, and ha... Your present position is health, wealth, happiness. Not, ha not and happiness. Happiness. In the fact that I'm not currently playing Starship Hector. Next, your immediate influence is awaiting or expecting trouble or change. So, it sounds like there might be trouble if I go back and play Starship Hector, because it will not have changed and will still be freaking impossible. Attainment at this time is consistent and stable. Oh wait, excuse me. Attainable at this time is consistent and stable. I mean, what? <laughs> I don't even know how that relates to Starship Hector. I guess it's stable. I guess it's... You know, uh, stable that I'm not playing Starship Hector. Present events are based on possible victories. Possible victories in, in Starship Hector. Clearly, well, I was going to say this is a lie, but no, this is 100% factual. So it must be it must be a victory in something else. Maybe not playing Starship Hector. Recent, it's all, I'm getting only staffs tonight. That's a little disappointing. Recent past events are a friendly, educated gentleman. Specifically, Mr. Hector from Starship Hector. Next. Another st I think it's all been step. No, I think it was a coin. The very first one. Near future influencing you. Near fl future influencing you soon is capable of selfishness struggle. Let's just let's just go back and marvel at that beautifully craft crafted sentence. Near future influencing you soon is capable of selfishness struggle. The struggle is always Starship Hector. You see, this is telling us everything we need to know about Starship Hector. 100% accurate. Also, I finally got a new card. You in a you in a proper perspective have our possible delay or separation i'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave that one as it is i don't need to explain it it's 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 clear how that relates to starship hector moving on next card next card this is views of others your tendencies as viewed by others are capable of deep deep concentration study and reflection deep concentration study and reflection on whether or not starship hector is beatable we must know moving on Next. We're almost to the end now. Soon we will- Oh my gosh! Hello! How you doing, buddy? Uh, you're hung upside down. I actually want to say, I, I read that the, uh, the Hanged Man doesn't actually have anything to do with, like, the violent death you would associate with it. I think it actually just refers to, like, an unusual perspective or something. Anyway. Your secret fears or wants are experiencing boredom or life in suspension between events. Your secret fears or wants are, are experiencing boredom or life in suspension between events. My life is in suspension. I, I am in amazing suspense about knowing whether or not Starship Hector is beatable. The final card will tell us what is the future. Tell us, Taboo! The conclusion of the issue is luxury and comfort. You don't have to play Starship Hector anymore because... that. There you go. 
now we have the answer to our question. I don't even need to explain it. And so let's let's our, our, let's find our lucky numbers. Our, our lucky numbers are. I want seven, and I want to like so so. I think these are supposed to be like states, but there's one for like where is it? A lot of these I don't know. B, there it was B.C. British Columbia. There are your lucky numbers. Anyway, <laughs> this has been the answer. This has been the future. Now we know. And we will know again next time on Taboo, the time machine on Nintendo. I am the Moy Chicken. Thanks for stopping by.